mixed group of Army, Navy, Air Force, and Marines all serve as part of a force protection team, which provides one of the first lines of defense for their base. The senior members of the team are sharing their skills with junior members to help everyone become even more effective in close quarters combat. Each one of us throughout Force Protection Bravo brings a different skill set to the team, and uh, all I was doing was uh, lending my part in it too, what I've gained throughout the years. Even with their shared backgrounds and experiences, it seems new members of the team were able to pick up techniques while solidifying shooting fundamentals. The first thing that comes to mind is uh, getting used to that safety. I mean, when we're at the range back home, I mean, it's very safe, very risk averse. But here, I mean, you know, we're going from target to target. And uh, that's something that you need to practice is being able to switch between uh, safety and fire. The movement under fire was enjoyable. It was relaxing. I just don't really get to do that on a normal range. I mean, it's nice to, you know, actually get hands on of what you might actually be doing. The most difficult technique is honestly ripping your safety. A lot of times soldiers want to just go to fire and leave it there. And then they'll continue walking down the street or start maneuvering down highways or hallways and not actually go back to safe. And that's when you start having your negligent discharges that injure somebody. And that's just one thing we really don't want to see at all. One safety topic that seemed to be on everyone's mind. Muzzle awareness. Muzzle awareness. Muzzle awareness. It's being aware of at all times where your muzzle is facing. Being able to move your body with your muzzle to both engage targets and remain safe at the same time. With safety in mind, the team was able to try a few new drills while learning new techniques from senior members. Whichever area you may be assigned to as a military member, if your particular FOB has a force protection team or you want to get more involved, I highly encourage it. Not a bad way to spend the first seven hours of a day. Marine Staff Sergeant Jason Price. That was beautiful. Kabul, Afghanistan. I like it.